Hi, I'm back here again in Google Sheets and I've just got a quick video here where I'm going to address a question that I've been asked a couple of times. Uh, it's about creating a script and giving authorization the very first time that you run that script. Um, a few people have been a little bit concerned or confused about how that works, so I'm just going to walk you through that now. Here I've got a completely new sheet. Um, I've just got some merged cells up here. One of them has text in it. And I have a drawing here, which is an image that I've uploaded. Um, and there's not yet a script assigned to that. There's, there's nothing there yet. So I'm going to quickly do up a script. I'll assign it to that button. And I'll show you the process of um, giving authorization to a script for the very first time. So I'm going to go into my script editor. And you'll see that this is brand new. There are no saved scripts here. Okay, that should do the trick. Uh, I'm now going to assign this function to that button which I created. Now we don't include the parentheses. And now when I click on this for the very first time, it's going to pop up and ask me for authorization. I'll say yes, we can continue. It's going to open up a sub window, so possibly your browser will block that from popping up. If it does, um, you should see an option to allow that pop up. Uh, in that sub window, we choose an account to run it from. It's a good idea to log out of any other Google accounts that you might be logged into, and then only log in with the one on which you want to assign that script. So we can choose that guy. It's going to tell you that the app is not verified. It's basically just saying that that little script that you wrote is not yet verified as being trustworthy by Google. Um, so if you're getting a script from someone else, obviously use caution, but if it's your own script, then you can trust that there's nothing nefarious going on. Um, so you can go ahead and uh, verify it. You can click on Advanced down here, and then Go to Test Script. and it will confirm what it's going to try to do so at the moment it's just editing your spreadsheets if you were doing other stuff in Google Drive or Gmail or whatever um, you would have multiple bullet points here um, outlining the different things that that script is going to possibly be able to affect um, so we can go ahead and allow that And there we go, the script now works. And now every time that you do that, it's not going to ask you for that same authorization. It's simply going to run the script. Um, if you edit the script and you do other stuff, like you're interrogating um, other files in the Google Drive or doing something with Gmail or something with Forms, it's probably going to run you through that again if you add that to this script. It's going to say, hey, you've added something to this script which you previously authorized and you'll need to go through the process to authorize it again. Anyway, I hope that's helped and answered a couple of questions. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next video.